Where'd the wine cups go? I could have sworn I left them here after I washed them. Ah, there they are. I'll have a cup too. Can you see if the cookies are still on the table? They are, and so are the fruits. Hmm. Oh, this is so bland. I should have gotten a few bottles of what Sino's group was drinking last night. Do tell. What were they drinking? Oh, right, I forgot to mention. So, I ran into Cyrus yesterday evening when I went to the tavern to pick up some things. He was hosting a dinner for Sino, Tainari, Kale, and the Traveler and Paimon. Anyway, they got a bottle of Lombard's new vintage for the table. At least, I think that's what it was. It looked pretty good. Hmm. Sounds like they're all tangled up in this. You know what it's about, right? Sixteen-year-old kid tried to extort Cyrus. He was asking for ten million mora. I heard some people talking about it on the streets, yes. Didn't take them long to catch the culprit. The sages are probably dealing with the case by now. <sighs> I wonder what Sir Nephis and the others will make of it. Oh, Cyrus showed me the extortion letter, too. It was crudely written, but the paper had this beautiful pattern on it that I've never seen before. Really caught my eye. Uh, give me a sec, I'll sketch it out for you. Okay, done. Take a look. You see what I mean? I don't think I've ever seen writing paper like this around before. God knows where the culprit got it from. Hmm. Interesting. These are all motifs associated with the tribes of the desert. What? Really? Take this, for instance. Looks like an outline of a spire, similar to the kind found on some ancient palaces. And the crisscrossing and mirroring here, I recognize that too. It bears a striking resemblance to an ancient emblem, one that hasn't been used in a very long time. Whose emblem is it? It's the emblem of the Temple of Silence. <laughs> 